did you make of this year of boxing? We saw uh, Terrence Crawford and Errol Spence. That's your old weight division. What did you make of that fight? That, that fight, if there's a rematch, then same thing happened. And, but uh, I'm willing to challenge to both of them. Who's the number one pound for pound fighter in your mind right now? Right now, it's hard to know. For me, it's uh, in a way. If you were to fight with Terrence Crawford, what weight would you want to fight at? 47. Why don't you go ahead and challenge him right now? Because my natural weight is 140. I'm just moving up to 147, so not to get it, getting hard to reduce. Let's get, it, let's get the challenge in. I need, I, need you to, I need you to tell Terrence Crawford what it is. Well, I mean, uh, I'm still here. I'm active, and I hope that by next year I can have a fight here in, in uh, Southeast. Nice place. Terrence Crawford is the most dangerous fighter, really, in boxing right now by most people's estimation. What do you do to defeat him? What, what, what would you do to beat Terrence Crawford that no one has been able to do yet? You know, just uh, counter the speed and um, hard punches and, you know, strong punches and move, 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 moving around like uh, side, side by side and throwing a lot of punches. You know, obviously boxing is a dangerous sport. If I keep fighting, why not just show up at all these things and have everybody fawn over you? I love boxing. I miss boxing. I mean, uh, you know, boxing is really my passion. Is there one thing that you can accomplish that would finally be like, okay, that's enough I got out of boxing? Is it a gold medal? Is it one more championship? What is it? One of my dreams is uh, to get a gold medal. <laughs>